Huckleberry, uh, do you think the U.S. troops will really leave Iraq without making a stink? Uh, rumors, negotiations for withdrawal are in the works. Yeah, I heard that. And uh, other people have pointed this out as well. The United States, I mean, most Americans, most, most of the Western world doesn't know that the United States is occupying Syrian land. Like, stealing Syrian oil. Like, most people don't know that. You mentioned that, what? Right? But the United States is, has military bases in, in Jordan, in Syria, and in Iraq. And there's rumors coming out, as Huckleberry is pointing out, that uh, United States, you know, they got bombed in, was it Syria, was it Jordan, and three U.S. soldiers got killed, right? Here's the kicker, right? People have pointed out that because of these negotiations, there's rumors that the United States might be pulling out of here. It might be a very dangerous sign because what it means is they're getting the 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 whole thing with the three U.S. soldiers being killed by the attack and a couple of dozen being injured by the attack, drone attack or whatever it was in Syria or Jordan, wherever it was. Right? They tried to play that to start the war with Iran, but it didn't work out too well with them. Right? So people are saying that if the United States is going to pull out their militaries, their soldiers out of iraq and syria what it means is that they're about to attack iran so what they're trying to do is get their soldiers out of the way right so it's extremely dangerous huckleberry extremely dangerous they should not be there they should be pulled out but considering where we are right now how things are playing out extremely dangerous time why are they pulling it out for example they what is it tuck tail and ran out of afghanistan right why did they run out of afghanistan so fast when the biden administration came in well most people were saying because they're going to kick up the wars in other places which they did now if they tuck tail and run out of iraq and syria why are they doing that and where is the next war going to be is it just going to be an expansion into attacking iraq oh sorry iran and what's going on in Pakistan with Imran Khan and stuff like this? And we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Extremely dangerous period. Extremely dangerous period.